Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I'm doing uh, an up-to-date makeup collection, my storage kind of videos. Now I'm not sure if this is going to be one part or two part at the moment, depending on how long it ends up being. Hopefully I can fit this all into one video and not have it drag on forever, but it might be a two part. Let's get going before it becomes way too long. Okay, so you're gonna have to excuse me as you can see me. So starting over here, this is like my makeup desk. So there's my tripod, my stool, and then my makeup desk. This is a different makeup desk as I'm in a different house. And so I have my old makeup desk in my daughter's room. If you were wondering, that's where my old makeup desk is. And yes, this is the new makeup desk. So tripod and my stool and my makeup desk. So all the drawers. So I bought an extra thing. So we'll start over here. These are two things that I ended up purchasing from a store called Heaton's. That's here in Ireland. And then I keep my Real Techniques brushes up here so I can grab them and bring them down as I am doing my makeup. I like to just kind of keep them there. Um, I have all my other brushes over there, you will see. So I have my Key West uh, album up here. If you've never heard of Key West, check them out on YouTube. They are awesome. So then I have my Miss Taylor Sigma Kabuki brush. It's a travel Kabuki brush uh, up there, and I love it. This little tiara was my daughter's play tiara. She broke it, and I thought it was just really cute, and I was like, I don't want to get rid of it. So in this first set of drawers, I bought this little thing at like um, a Euro store or something like that. I think it was like a two euro store and I think this cost like two euros so it was very affordable and my sister, my daughter's like put Hello Kitty stickers on it and I love Hello Kitty so I thought what a cute little place to put Hello Kitty stickers. Don't judge me. I'm still young. So in the first drawer which I will take out I have elf lip stuff. So I have the plumping lip glazes here and here. I have their old candy shop lip glosses cute little packaging. I haven't used them all that much, sadly. I always forget about them. I need to put them in my purse. And then I have my favorites, which is their super glossy lip shines, and I have them in almost every color that they have that I liked. And yeah, so that's the first drawer. I'm not going to talk too long about each what's in each drawer because I don't want to make it too long for you guys. And then the second drawer, again, is e.l.f. All of these are e.l.f. in this little green thing. So I have the Hypershine lip glosses in a bunch of colors. And then I also have the e.l.f. Um, Luscious Liquid Lipsticks in a bunch of colors as well. And then I have the Shimmer Lip Glosses in three colors. I will be doing a e.l.f. lip lippy kind of collection so keep your eyes out for that and then you'll see like all the different colors and I'll swatch loads of them and stuff like that so if you want to see that please leave it down below let me know whoops I'm pulling it out okay and then I have the conditioning lip balms I have three of them here and again I will talk about them in a lip collection I have the matte lip colors I only have two of them right now I definitely want to get more of those I have the lip stains from e.l.f., the minty lip gloss, and the two-in-one conditioning gloss there. So there's more room in that one, so I can get more lip stuff from e.l.f. And my husband's like, do you need more lip stuff? And I'm like, heck yes. Okay, so that's that And there. These are just some earrings that I bought off of eBay, and they're just really cute. I don't wear them all that often because they're quite big. And this was on an uh, a ring if you're wondering and it broke off so I just kept a little turtle for a little accent so I'm going to start in this one I'm sure if you've seen any of my elf or any of my makeup collections you've seen lots of this stuff mineral elf another elf drawer I have like mineral eyeshadows and these which I don't use that much anymore which is the shimmer of facial whips yes I don't use those that much anymore sadly or I haven't lately, anyway. And then I have loads of their, like, eyeshadow quad, quads? Yes, quads. And then I have this with eyeshadows in it. And one of my favorite eyeshadows from e.l.f. is the Six Pen. I think it's, like, natural 
something. I'm not quite sure. It doesn't have a name on it anymore. I have some of their cream eyeliners, cream and powder eyeshadow duos, and a makeup lock and seal back there. So that's some of my elf stuff. This is probably going to be way too long to put in one video. But anyway, more elf stuff. So elf blushes, complexion thing, and bronzer, golden bronzer. I have Sunkissed Bronzer, Elf Booster, Eye Brightener, HD Powder, a blush that broke that I stuck in here. <laughs> I know, crazy. Uh, Elf Glow. I have some of these, which I like to use as like cream sh um, blushes. And it's the All Over Color Sticks. I have a few of those. This broke a long time ago, and I decided to try to fix it. And look how warped it looks. It's the Trans, or it's the Luminance Healthy Glow Bronzer thing. It didn't work as well. It kind of went weird, but at least it's not like all broken everywhere. And then I have two cream blushes. So that's what's in there. Here is kind of blushes, bronzer kind of packet here. So I have like a glitter cream from MAC, um, glitter bronzer from Bonnebelle, it's just a dark bronzer, which I don't use too much because in Ireland you don't really need a bronzer. So these are my Fashionista um, blushes, which you can check out. I have all of them swatched and everything in a video, which I'll try to leave down below. And if I don't, just check out my channel. It's on there. And Revlon highlighter, pure confection highlighter. More Elf, their old style packaging blushes. I have a bunch of them there. Oh, this is going to be a long video. MUA's old um, packaging and new packaging blushes, their cream, and also a sleek blush, which is in oh, pixie pink. I hope this is in focus. And uh, a cream blush from Essence that I have talked about in a haul recently. Um, my Vivo, it is so huge. Golden Days Vivo Bronzer. Um, Look Beauty, little cheeky trios. Love this one, absolutely awesome. Candy Floss is the color. And then more Vivo, They're all, these are awesome. If you can get blushes from Vivo, these ones I would highly recommend. It's the blush and highlighter duos. The duos aren't great, but the blushes are awesome. I love them. And just some more blushes here, which is like W7 and like an Avon one. And I got a Wet n Wild Mega Glow. Oh, this is going to be a long video. I have a MAC Mineralized Skin Finish. And some more W7s, which are there and there. So, yeah. Kind of crazy. Okay, and then over here is my next one. And I have over here... These are, I'm not going to pull out loads of them. I have my um, beauty kind of blender. It's like a rip off of it. I just thought I would try, see what I thought in here, just so it doesn't get like really dusty or anything. But I have mostly like mineral. Um, these are from 17. They're just mineral eyeshadows or pigments or whatever you want to call them. That's what those are. And loads in there as well. Some from Primark, some from eBay. I have like an MUA one back there. Uh, two true one. Oh, loads. I have Annabelle's, which Annabelle you can get in Canada, if you're wondering. And loads of other little things in there. That'll take me forever to go through. So I'll pull this one out. This is um, eyeshadows. These are just single eyeshadows. So I have my Dainty Dolls. If you want to see these, I have them in a haul, a collective haul that I've just recently done. Check that out. I have MAC eyeshadows. Famous eyeshadows, more MAC. These are all Essence eyeshadows, all of them here. Uh, more MAC. What's under here? Just a famous trio. Yeah. And yeah, some glitter quad. And then if I pull that out, I have down here, I have these are all these white ones, are natural collections. I have, um, which one's this one? Go. Um, some Essence duos there, two of them, a green one and a blue one. And then these black ones are 17, and these black ones, which are more matte, are Annabelle, which you can buy in Canada, like I said, Wet n Wild, Essence, uh, Lancome, Essence Cream Shadow, 
what's this? Number seven. Uh, I, have, I also have like, whoops, uh, Catrice. These are three Catrice shadows here. Natural Collection Duo. Yeah, so loads of shadows in there as well. Oh, and like oh, along here I have like my Avon shadow thing and um, number seven quad. Oh, don't want to mess up. And on the side here I have two wild and crazy eyeshadows. And I have another, I think it's like a wet. You can't really buy wet and wild here, but occasionally you can find them like old stuff kind of still in packaging, but like older style, uh, wet and wild makeup. That's a duo there. So those are some of my singles. And then this bottom one is all like foundations and powders and things like that. So, and concealers. So I have like my primer, matte perfect primer there. I have like powder and a wet and wild shimmer. And I have like a tester for Avon, a new, um, ta-ta for now from Penny's wet and wild coverall concealer. Um, a concealer, was it wet and wild concealer in like a, pencil, but I didn't have a huge sharpener, so I had to like cut the product out. Oh, long, long story. <laughs> Some like essence powder that I'm almost done. Elf powder, uh, natural collection powder, MUA's, uh, what is it called? Hide and concealer. I've got two of those. This one's the one I'm using right now. And this is the new one. This is the MUA coverall. Ooh, I love this. This is the L lasting Perfection Collection Tooth That Well, I think it's just called Collection now. 16 hour concealer. Love that stuff. And then I have, yeah, more concealers. Ah, this is long. MUA Matte Perfect Loose Powder. Love that. Then I have the Full Coverage MAC Foundation and a MAC Shimmer thing that I got a little while ago, quite a while ago. But it's just shimmer. Then I have MUA's BB Cream, MUA's Matte Foundation, oh, sorry, MUA's Matte Perfect Foundation, Revlon's Photo Ready Foundation, uh, Avon's Ideal Flawless Foundation, a Catrice Infinite Matte Foundation, which I love, I love, love, love. I also have this MUA Under Your Skin Foundation in Porcelain, which is really nice, Vivo Highlighter. And yeah, those are my foundations and concealers. Then I have just like a fighting animal testing pin. I have my clear skin professional blemish mark treatment, which I use occasionally. And oh, I love this stuff. This I got from Avon when I was selling it. It's the leave in treatment uh, Moroccan argan oil. Love this stuff. Awesome. If you can get your hands on it pictures of my family. I have these cute little two little holders that I got from my mother-in-law and they're supposed to be for candles but I was like yeah I don't use long stem candles very much so I thought I'd use them for two uh, lip glosses that I have that I only have one of each brand so I have a MAC lip gloss lip glass sorry in Nymphetti pretty sure. Now I don't know if that's discontinued now. I'm not sure. And this is a NYX butter gloss, which I love so much. Peaches and cream. Love these. Definitely want to get some more of these. And then I have just like my little mirror that I pull close and I keep little clips on it. Over here in this container thing, I keep my eyeliners. I thought it was just so pretty. It's from my mother-in-law as well. She didn't really use it for anything. So I thought I could use that. So yeah. Another picture of my brother and my daughter when she was small. And these are all like eye brushes. So I have like blending brushes, shadow brushes, um, you know, this little thing is supposed to be for your eyelashes, but I use it for my brows kind of brushes. So mostly e.l.f. in there actually. So yeah, and then down to here, this is just like a little flower thing. I just keep little hair things. So I like in this top thing, I keep like bobby pins and stuff. It's not really makeup and just like little black hair clips and stuff like that. So, so just clips and things like that. Just so you guys know what's in there. This is another little thing of just like little tiny brushes. Like I keep my eyebrow pencil in there, my, you know, tweezers, a lip brush. That's a travel friendly. It's really cool. Um, some other like eye brushes that are really small. That's what I keep in there. 
Back here, I keep my L'Oreal Satin Finish Foundation. Uh, foundation. <laughs> oh gosh, hairspray. Uh, clean and Clear Blackhead. Um, clear. Uh, Blackhead Cleaner Cleanser. And then in this, uh, it says sugar on it. I keep my. It's supposed to be for in the kitchen. I <laughs> I keep my cotton balls in there for removing nail polish. And then. <sighs> Brushes go in here as long as well as mascaras and I have my NYX pencils in here. I have my eyelid primers, uh, just four in here. I have just the normal ones. They're all from e.l.f. You know, I have like a brownish kind of one, a white one, and then two of the regular ones. Uh, the Makeup Mist and Set and I also have the Zit Zapper from e.l.f. I have an e.l.f. Lip liner and blending brush in fuchsia or pink uh, grapefruit, and then I have another pink. Yeah, yeah. Um, as you can see, eyelash curlers back there. Back over this way, more mascaras, eyeliners. Um, so I have like Elf. Love these Elf eyeliners, and then some little Essence eyeliner things, and a natural collection eyeliner. So then I keep other brushes up here. Um, e.l.f. 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 These are all e.l.f. brushes. You can see my e.l.f. I'm pretty sure I did an e.l.f. brush collection video, so you can check that out. I have a brush cleanser here for daily brush cleanser. That's where I keep it with my brushes. I have my Sigma F80 brush and so on and so on. Brushes. That's where I keep lots of my brushes in there. I think that's where I'm going to stop with this video and I'm going to go on to the drawers. So that'll be part two.